Welcome to Wall Street Mojo. To know about this video hyperlink, watch the video till the end. And also, if you are new to this channel, then you can subscribe or by clicking the bell icon that is given below. Well, welcome everyone. Today we are going to talk about an Excel function that is called hyperlink. Now, how exactly this function works? We are here to learn this. If you go down, there's a couple of details that are written examples and uh, the links that are given to examples for the same you can download well see the hyperlink excel sheet it enables you to create a shortcut shortcut to what to a file or basically a url so the hyperlink function is a built-in function in excel that opens another page or a file which you click it so once you once click it points you frequently to another page or an email address or program so the hyperlink is in excel sheet can be uh, probably a text or it can be a picture it can be anything okay how does it, that exactly works you can just start with is equal to that's what we normally do to start any formula just write hyperlink do you just the moment i've just written h y the Excel gives me a couple of suggestions. There's different, different formulas. Now, we are studying hyperlink here. It says it creates a shortcut or jumps that opens up a document that is stored on your hard drive or and a network server or probably on the internet. Well, on the let's let's go on the explanation part to understand this. I need to explain you this and then I can move forward. The hyperlink Excel sheet basically accepts the formal following arguments. First is called the link location. So this is the path or the document name to the file is to be opened. So the link location can be referred to as, you know, a specific, uh, you can say place in a file and such as like, you know, you can say cell or name range in an excel sheet or workbook or to a bookmark or in a word file so, so these paths can be to a document that is stored on a computer drive and the path can also be you know i can tell you uniform resource locator can we say this and that is what we call as url right and it is a part on the internet or on the internet or a universal naming now there's a thing called note the hyperlink function in excel is valid for internet urls only so link location can be a text that is enclosed in the quotation marks or cell references can be passed that contains you know the link as a text strings and if the path specified in the link location is let's say no longer available in the computer drive or does not exist or cannot be navigated an error will pop up when you click the link so that is possible the next is the friendly name. This is option. It is a text string or numeric value that is displayed in the cell in the form of a link. So the text is displayed in blue or probably underlying format indicating that this is a clickable link. And if the friendly name is omitted, the link location will be displayed as a jump text. Now the friendly name can be a text or it can be a name. It can be a value or a cell that contains the jump text or value. Now, if the friendly name returns, let's say, an error value, error value, right? It will show us something like this. There will be a hashtag value, right? So the cell throws an error instead of the jump text. So how to insert this uh, hyperlink in an Excel sheet? Okay, we are going to learn here the same. Let's begin. The step number one that will go is you need to select the text or probably the cell or the picture on which you would like to insert a hyperlink in Excel sheet. Second, on the insert tab, on the insert tab, click the hyperlink and you can go on the right click the text or picture that you want to select as the Excel hyperlink option on the shortcut menu right so these are the two options as you can see just just press the the right button on your uh, on your mouse and you will get a hyperlink over here as an 
option right and third is by in the insert tab over here if you if you go to the insert tab over here you get a hyperlink option over here so these are the three ways you can do it you go over here they they tell you to select the values right so how to execute the hyperlink in the excel sheet with the examples so the excel hyperlink example illustrates you know how the hyperlink function in excel is being used to send an email or open a document and move between the sheets just by clicking the link so in first the hyperlink example you can see you will see that in you know, the hyperlink function in excel is used to send an email okay when you are sending an email using a link you should add prefix uh, probably malto to an email address which is an html code to send in an email the moment you click on the the link it redirects you to the email composer page with the given email id to the recipient so what i'm going to do i'm going to put some hyperlinks here let's start with is equal to hyperlink the link location okay you can use the link location that is available or instead of this if if you don't want to do this just go to the hyperlink tab in the insert tab go there and from the desktop let's say uh, you select these five let's say this microsoft word and then you can press ok let's take uh, another example over here again I'm, I'm taking this insert tab click to hyperlink and i have this word file called wall street mojo right i'll select this file okay i'll get a hyperlink here now once i click on this file that file will automatically open up so i had written over here so i had written over here as hyperlink right now let's write that uh, today we are going to study hyperlink function so once i write this let me save it and i'm closing this so my file is over here saved right now if in future if i want to open this file so it gives the extension as you can see users krishan gohal desktop wall street mojo so this is the extension that is showing you once i open this i don't have to go to that excel file go to desktop and open the file i just have to double click this and the file will automatically open up as you can see the file has automatically opened up in front of us whatever we had saved so this is how the hyperlink function that can be used now we have got the idea how to use this function you can use uh, text this is also one way the second way and the third is the formula right so try and choose the one that is more you can say easy for you now what are the things that you know, you should note for the hyperlink function in excel first remember one thing the link location it should be supplied as a text okay it should be supplied as text string in quotation marks or a cell reference that contains a link path or a text second it should be a friendly name like over here we have written wall street mojo and the friendly name is not supplied then the excel hyperlink function will display the link location as the friendly name if, if instead of this if i remove this and if i don't name it then it is going to show us the link now to select a cell that contains the hyperlink without jumping to the destination use the arrow key to select the cell just use the arrow key uh, and alternatively you can click on the cell and hold the mouse button down until the cursor changes so that's it for this particular topic you can download the hyperlink excel template uh, that is given on the uh, the website you can you can down it is also given in the link below you can download the excel file so if you have learned and enjoyed watching this video please like comment on this video and subscribe to our channel for the latest updates thank you everyone